And welcome back to The Factor Uncensored. A tragic story has a lot of people talking now. Our star high school athlete in Michigan takes his own life after he was blackmailed. Told, send us money or we release nude photos of you. That act is called sextortion. And tonight we explain what parents need to know out there. It's a tragedy to see what happened to this 17 year old in Michigan, blackmailed, or as they call it now, sextortion. So for many of those who are not aware of what sextortion is, what is it exactly and how popular is it? Hi, hi Isaiah, thanks for having me on and discussing such an important topic. So sextortion is part of a widespread pandemic that's happening on social media, where hackers impersonating scammers are defrauding innocent social media users by tricking them into being someone that perhaps is interested in a romantic relationship with them, establishing that connection and then seeking out nude photos of each other. They start by exchanging a random picture of themselves and then prompt a response. Once they have that nude picture of you, they've now baited you and are going to use that against you. And that's what happened to this 17 year old football player. He thought it was a young teenage girl his age and he was exchanging pictures with her and they used that picture against him, wanted $300 then $1,000. Then the poor kid took his own life because he felt like he was going to be blackmailed and humiliated on social media. That is, that is correct, and that's how this story unfolded. Uh, unfortunately, scams of this nature have been happening for quite some time. However, we're seeing in the social media world uh, this being part of a huge trend that's just transpiring, and it is surging you know, into, into the new year. And unfortunately, um, situations like this are triggering suicide because these kids feel helpless once their naked photos um, are out or leaked. You know, nothing ever good comes from sharing a nude photo, no matter what. And I think that, um, you know, this is a call to action for parents of teens and children to really encourage their kids to never, ever share any, any content of that nature. And it's really difficult for parents to monitor what their children are doing on the internet, especially teenagers, but they have to do the best or it will end in a tragedy like this because they're unscrupulous, vicious people who are out there looking to take advantage of our children. That's exactly right. You know, our kids just become an open target on social media. And I think this is also why kids are enamored. Uh, social media is not always a, a, a happy place. It can sometimes be a toxic place. And sometimes kids are enamored with the dis disappearing photo feature that Snapchat started because mm -hmm. they think it's safe. They feel safe sharing this type of content because they feel like it's going to disappear. However, the person on the other side of the screen can always use that against you absolutely all they have to do is take a screenshot and they have That's your right. image forever karen always good to talk to you and we appreciate your expertise here on the factor on censor